Mr. Wang, thank you very much for taking our interview. Could you give us or our audience a brief introduction about yourself and also the Asia Pacific Institute for Hydrotherapy and Climate Therapy Tourism? Mm, okay, I'm happy to introduce myself first. Uh, my name is uh, Jeff Wang, also uh, Wang Jie. Yeah. So I'm the director of uh, Asia Pacific Chongqing Hydrotherapy and uh, Climate Therapy Tourism uh, Institute. Mm, this institute is uh, uh, established uh, with the aim to help Chongqing to make uh, to make Chongqing a world class uh, hot spring tourism city and uh, health tourism destination. Um, you know, uh, Chongqing uh, had got a name of uh, China hot spring capital of China hot spring capital in 2011 and uh, uh, global capital of uh, hot spring in 2012. Uh, that means uh, Chongqing uh, has been recognized uh, both domestically and uh, globally as a world global, uh, a global hot spring city. For the time being, Chongqing uh, has still uh, tourism oriented uh, hospital industry so the next step uh, uh, next stage for the hospital industry development is will be focused on uh, uh, health and wellness tourism and uh, uh, to match the international standards as a, a global hospital tourism destination so that's why uh, under the support of the uh, Chongqing government and uh, some uh, uh, state-owned companies, we, uh, decide, we have decided to build such a mixed economy uh, uh, institute uh, focused on the hot spring uh, uh, industry clusters. And, uh, this supply chains. Uh, the main function of this institute uh, is uh, evidence-based evidence-based study for hospital and uh, products innovation, and international exchange, and uh, training and education, and uh, standard standardization. <clears throat> guidelines for the Chongqing hospital industry. That sounds very encouraging, actually. Yeah, and uh, also, like you said, uh, the institute's aim is also bring, let's say, like the uh, match the international standard to direct the way the uh, Chongqing's hot spring industry will develop, right? Mm -hmm. And also, let's say this time symposium, right? Also bring together like so many experts worldwide in this industry. So, could I hear about like uh, what are the highlights? Yeah, about this time's sim uh, symposium we'll have. Uh, this is the second uh, symposium on uh, hydrotherapy and uh, climate therapy tourism. Uh, to compare with the first uh, uh, symposium, uh, the highlights of this symposium have uh, two points. One is uh, after one year's uh, hard efforts, uh, we have compiled collected uh, uh, more than 37 uh, uh, literatures and papers on hot springs, uh, both medical and wellness. Uh, so we, uh, we will have uh, launched uh, the first volume of the uh, paper collections uh, about the hot spring. This is uh, the, the first of its kind in China. Uh, so tomorrow afternoon you will see the launching of these uh, paper collections. The second is uh, this uh, uh, this symposium will be more uh, concentrated on the <coughs> operation and the action, more proactions. So the last time is we are maybe more 
literature, a little uh, more academic. This is this time will be more uh, grounded. So, um, so this the speech, the five speeches, uh, on the same person, uh, from uh, uh, both from the uh, like, like a, a specific object uh, project or uh, hospital resort in operation, and uh, from the uh, Asia Pacific areas, most of them. So uh, this is different from last time. Last time, last time, the, uh, the uh, almost all the speech speakers from Europe. This time was uh, all from the Asia Pacific areas, and such as from uh, Thai, Australia and uh, uh, Japan. Chinese Taiwan and uh, uh, even from Thailand, so I think this uh, this time, uh, uh, I think it's more Asia Pacific. Um, it's uh, more rounded. I see, and also uh, I we also would like to hear how do you see the future of the hot spring industry in Chongqing? What are the good things we will keep, and what are the changes and improvement that will be made? I think we will continue to develop our existing uh, hospital types of uh, entertainment uh, leisure uh, hospitals because I think it's the the, uh, the first side of hospital is uh, entertainment social it's a social hospital uh, but uh, in the future we will focus on the uh, wellness and the health side of hospitals so. Uh, the next phase, uh, maybe five years, Chongqing's uh, hot spring will be more rich for covered both uh, entertainment, and leisure, and relaxation, and also health, and wellness, and even medical spa. As a global capital of hot spring, Chongqing will continue to lead in the way of uh, China's hot spring tourism. Thank I'm sure. Yeah, that sounds very cool, you know, like the we keep everything actually compared with Europe, like we do actually we do good with like entertaining and also like relaxing thing, right? But also if we catch up with the medical like therapy like stuff yes. and we will be, you know, like on both ways. Like so that's the that's the true meaning of war capital, yes. right, of hot springs. Thank you very much, Mr. Wang, for this uh our introduction okay. about this field. Thank you. Thank you.